Hey everybody, welcome to Super Quest Saga, the show where we here at the Dungeon Cast sit around the table and play some Dungeons and Dragons. My name is Will Stark, and I shall be the unknowable Dungeon Master for this evening. <laughs> Joining me as always is... Josh Freeland, playing Sebastian <laughs> Crenshaw, Half-Orc Paladin. Every special guest, Jake, playing Persephone Goldpedal, the Furbo Druid. I'm Brian, and today <laughs> I'll be playing Human Warlock, Carter Huttenberg. And last we left you guys, um, you guys had made your way through the laboratory of Dr. Zahn. Mm -hmm. And you guys had discovered some crazy shit. There was a conference call with like a elven justice saint. They were talking about the forsaken. They were talking about blood stuff and genetics and ancient writings. Um, Sebastian has a new ancient Blackstone club. Yup. And you guys find yourself on this glass bridge extending into the entrance of the Black Ziggurat. Scary place. In between episodes, Carter went to the generator room by himself. And did what? <laughs> and did what? <laughs> Hello. So sorry I missed you last time. I set up a little contingency in case I'm away from the ship when the signal kicks on. I hope you enjoyed my little story. I put a lot of thought into telling it, seeing as I've well, I've never told it before. And we'll probably be to the next bit before long. I know you're itching to hear it. And you should be, trust me. It's a good one. Anywho, I caught you this time. Found a generator my bracer jack could interface with. Hard to believe it's still working, all things considered. But it puts out plenty of power to bring me up to broadcasting potential. Unfortunately, I happen to be in a bit of a tight spot. There's a nasty stink jungle outside. I'm in an ancient lab. Big old ziggurat over there. You know, that sort of thing. One thing is clear. The old doctor was up to no good before he had to go. Honestly, I'm having some trouble piecing all this together. And frankly, in regards to our movement forward, I have some concerns. The first, as usual, would be the subject, Perimeta. None of our ventures so far seems to have triggered any of her more unique behaviors. No lost memories resurfaced yet. I'm not sure what to expect if we happen to actually come across our dear stray gnome. As a matter of fact, I'm not exactly sure of my primary directive in that scenario either. I suppose when it's my business to know, I'll be coming to know it. See, that's how this thing works. I relinquish my body and soul into the gaping maw of indiscernible void to which I am compelled to pledge my undying loyalty. And in exchange, I get to blast holes in the skulls of my enemies with the snap of my finger. Ooh, and so much more. Something in that old ziggurat's got a chill running up my spine. We're close. I can't wait. <laughs> What? <laughs> I'm confused, but we're going to keep going. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, so stretch, uh, stretching out before you is this glass bridge, and you guys can see a dark stairway descending into the Black Ziggurat, and there is a deep, almost impenetrable darkness um, that even you two with dark vision aren't able to see through. I mean, you can see through it, but it's still darkness. Mm. Does that make sense? It does. Yeah. Did you recharge your bracer, Jack? Is that what you did? No, I made a video, audio recording. Probably. Oh, my God. Okay. Interesting. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Okay, I get it. Okay, not confused now. anymore. Now um, we got it. Yeah. You, you got some but special we, eyes, right? You got those goggles. Can you see through this dark? Because we can't, I can't see through this dark. I use my new special eyes. Yeah. To I see mean, through the dark. Well, it's infrared, so. Any roaches? No. <laughs> Kill. <laughs> nah, man. All right. I guess let's go. So, do you still have your dancing lights out? Uh, yeah, if it's dark, yes. Yes, and it is. Okay. Uh, so, as you enter the ziggurat area with your dancing, dancing lights, lights, you notice that the light from your dancing lights is dancing dimmed lights. actively. Oh. So, it's no longer bright light, it's now dim light. Okay, um, then I, I move... So, I, half the distance. I'll probably, just for flavor, move... They were split into four. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm going to, like, cinch them up into two, one and one. Mm-hmm. So, there's two. Okay. Hmm. Concentrate the light a little more. Yeah, but. sure. Um, but yeah, they're noticeably dimmed, <clears throat> and Victoria like reaches out and touches the stone, and she says, this stone must be rich with umbrium ore. That's the ore, that's the metal that uh, illithids use on their ships. <laughs> Technical difficulties. <laughs> that's the metal that uh, illithids use on their ships, and it, it, it causes this strange effect of like dimming lights. Hmm. Interesting. Sucking the light out of the stuff in the, in the yeah. air. All the light in the air is getting sucked into the rock. 
Oh, illithid stuff. So yeah, there's stairs just descending. Do you guys just descend them? How do you guys approach this? So we're just on the outside of the... Yeah, you guys are like at the lip of the ziggurat. You're at the mouth of madness, just <laughs> staring down into it. Into the mouth. <laughs> Into the mouth we go, right? Let's get you and your nice fingies into this mouth. <laughs> You're going to be, oh my God. What's marching order, guys? <laughs> Me in the are, middle. Are you going to be f- first because you can see shit? Carter Sandwich. I can't oh, see. Okay. I can so, see, so I can see less to, than everybody else. going to be last because bef- he's going to watch everybody enter. And he's going to pause before he enters because he's taken aback by everything. And he deep down he's thinking, you know, he's going to walk into some orc ruins and stuff like that. So he's having a hard time with this. Right I could now. potentially. So he's, he's pausing and he's going to watch everybody like, walk. Someone else go first. Yeah, he's just like, <laughs> and then he'll say a little something to himself and, and follow everybody in. I could potentially okay. do wild shape into something and give us some more light and kind of be in the front and kind of root off our way through here. <laughs> if that's agreeable to everybody. I don't see. I like that idea. Yeah. It's prim. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, then I'll wild shape into the mystic Grimalkin. Nice. Uh, and use my gem illumination. So you said it was a red thing, red mm-hmm. gem. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, but I think when I do it, because I have like the blue tuft of fur, that it's a blue gem. Sure. Sounds great. And uh, yeah, I can emit as a bonus action. I can emit my garnet can shed 10, 10 foot light and dim light additionally 10. Okay, so, so what you're getting is five is and it five. Five now. and five now? Yeah. Is it even I mean that's ten feet. It so is, like right? from where I'm standing, he would light yeah. this whole room up. Okay. Between me and you, we've got a good, yeah. a then good I'll range go, of light. I'll yeah. go in front then. So the stairs ascend, uh, and they just keep on descending and you guys are going hundreds and uh, hundreds of feet down. And kick. eventually after three hundred feet of descending, the uh, area levels out into a chamber that's about twenty five feet by twenty feet wide. There's a wall directly ahead of you, and it has a large symbol on it. The symbol is that of of, of eye surrounded by outward-reaching tentacles. Mm. Mm. There are orcish rooms that form a spiral around the symbol. Um, again, can't really can't make out what Can I roll saying. a history check on that? Something I never do. You don't need to. Oh, yay! <laughs> you know what it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, I do. You said eye with tendrils coming yes. out of it? Yes. It's the Illuminati. <laughs> it is. It is the Illuminati. Uh, where can we go in? Oh, oh, sorry. I, I didn't finish it. Uh, <laughs> I was like, there's got to be something. Sorry, I just I got so caught up with uh, that bit. The um, eye. So um, there are more stairs descending from the northern wall, like to your left. Mm, I love the left. I love stairs. Let's go. Let's go straight in those stairs. Hold on. Uh, Jacob's writing. <laughs> I got to take a look at your notes on these these days. I'm so curious what you write. In our other They're games, he trust. Uh, <laughs> in, our, in our other games, he like saves me. Oh lot, yeah. As the dun- yeah. as the dungeon master. Super yeah. curious. Um, we will, yeah, we'll, we'll, so I, <laughs> I take it you guys descend them down these stairs. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now these ones also meow, extend meow, very meow. far, 200 feet. You guys are going meow, way down meow. there. Mm. Uh, before they level out into a long hallway. Uh, this hallway extends from east to west. So like you get to the end of the stairs and the hallway actually goes this way. Mm. Okay. Does that make sense? So mm-hmm. we gone down uh, for for our listeners is like they descend down the stairs and then they have to hook a right because that's the direction the hallway goes. Is this gotcha. map you gave me like accurate so far? Like we went down three hundred yes. feet and then now we're going down another two hundred uh-huh. feet. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. Cool. Um. Okay, so this hallway appears to be a tome of sorts. Um. Oh, sorry, or tomb, I should say. Oh, tomb, tomb, right? Tomb. Okay. Yeah. Tomb's, tomb's a book. Be. Tomb's Tom- a book. Tombs is like where bodies are. Yes. Tomb of foes, tomb of foes. I want the second one. <laughs> yes. The latter. Right. A tomb of foes? Because yeah, they're all dead. Fo- sure, tomb of foes. As long as they don't get up. <laughs> so it's a tomb of sorts. Um, there are stone coffins uh, lying in outcuts along the bottom section of the wall. So what mm. I mean by that is like if you're walking and you look like- at the wall to your right, you look down, there is like a cutout... Um, like cubby, I guess, for the coffin that and that's tucked into the wall. Like how people sleep on trains. I don't know. Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, like in Skyrim when you're going down the... Um, yes, yeah. like Skyrim. Yeah. Um, like Link in Breath of the Wild when, before he wakes up. No. No, no. not like that. <laughs> he got a um, really good cubby. So the, these, these coffins line the hallway along the north and south walls for the entire extent of the hallway. Um, above the coffins are murals... Um, uh, depicting uh, depictions of orcs with drums and pipes facing to the west. I'm gonna snap some pictures of that stuff. Yeah, sure. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Do you guys uh, continue down the hallway? Mm-hmm. As you continue down the hallway, uh, the depictions change to orcs with dead bodies on pikes, all yeah. still facing to the west. Um, as I take it, you're snapping photos. Yep. As you continue, um, you come to the end of the hallway, and there is. Okay, yeah, you you come to the end of the hallway, and then those murals continue to change, and at this end of the hallway, uh, the orcs are now all kneeling and praying in fervor and in fear, arms outstretched towards the sky. Um, and they're outreached towards these beams of light that are kind of carved into the stone, and these beams of light extend to the very end of the hallway, which comes to just a flat-facing wall that you guys are facing. And... Um, the light beams are extending from this amorphous monster with a thousand teeth and a thousand eyes with a thousand tentacles. Oh, shit. And right below this mural and directly in front of you guys is a statue of a humanoid man. It's faceless and it seems to be made out of this black stone. And it is um, on its knees with his arms outstretched above it. Carter, at this point, you hear in your mind... Um, a voice humming with glee. Okay. Because this is an old one mm. that we're looking at. Humming mm-hmm. with glee. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and the mm-hmm. hallway seems to come to an end here. Carter probably. Even like, though the map says differently. Ooh. Because Carter's like fighting back a smile probably. Right. Like he's like, that's not my smile. <laughs> that's not my smile. Stop it. <laughs> um, yeah. With like a twitch, I'll investigate. Yeah. Uh, as a matter of fact, the, the glee, is it's less glee and it's more like smug satisfaction, like superiority. So yeah, okay. Yeah. Would Sebastian recognize the the creature? No, no right. None Didn't of this. So. You're like, the fuck? No one <laughs> ever will. Yeah. yeah. Didn't, Didn't think so, but... Can I roll investigate on stuff? The room? Uh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. I'm just... Uh, Bad. Nine. Yeah. yeah. I'm um like weaving through Prim and <clears throat> Vicky's legs, basically, and... Yeah. Purring, I guess. If my, <laughs> yeah. If my big friend is... instinctively <laughs> reach down and start scratching your head. Yeah, I'm just... <laughs> And she's she's wow. like she's looking a little bit disturbed, and she's like, "This place, this place gives me a really bad feeling." Does it? Uh, shall we and look I'm for a gonna... door? Um, Map says it keeps can, going. Can I'm I thinking it might be right. Pop a divine <laughs> sense real quick. Uh Would sure. I get any yeah. Um, hmm. so, so, so what does it do? Celestial again? fiend or undead within sixty feet? No, none nothing, of those. Nothing none of those, weird. No. Okay. Just weird prim vibes, right? Probably you get, prim. You just get the prim vibes? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. You get the celestial and fiend from prim. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah, the, the map you have, I believe it shows like a line pointing down. Yes, yeah, a 40 foot hallway. Um, does anyone else want to roll an investigation? Yeah. Can I while I'm a cat? Sure, yeah. Fuck it. Uh, 13. Yeah. 13 for me, too. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Prim, Prim and on, Victoria Prim. to the rescue. Uh, Prim nails it with hey. a 20. Good job, Prim. There it is. So Prim's she looking at the map because you, you shared the map file, right? With everybody else. Yeah, so she's looking at it. Air she drop. goes, I don't, think that's a, I don't think that's a hallway. I think there's a drop. Oh, shit. It's a staircase. I think it's... Can we move this, this statue? Wrong lever. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, yeah she, she asked if you guys can move the statue, yeah. So uh, Sebastian will get on the side to see if he can start pushing it. Yeah, give me a strength check. How long has this all been going on, us going down the cigarette? Um, I mean, you I mean, guys are probably a good 15 minutes into yeah, walking, not maybe long. longer. Oh, okay. 300 foot stairway, and then there was a, a, a symbol on a wall. It can't have been more than 30 yeah, minutes. Two, well, I, j- I just take it that you guys are investigating as you guys are going. Like, you're looking yeah. at stuff, oh, yeah. you're taking notes, you're taking photos. Yeah, I still think like 30 minutes probably. Okay, yeah. So we rolled a 15. Uh, yeah, yeah. You uh, you don't move it all the way, but it's Good moving. Enough. Okay. Um, I don't know if anyone wants to help him. So I don't. I actually. can't. I'm a cat. Oh yeah, you're a cat. <laughs> so you're on your own. Give me another shake <laughs> check. Damn it. Ooh, I fell on my face one. again. Okay, Prim and Vic, Vicky are gonna get in. <laughs> oh, damn it. fine. Everyone roll together. Yeah, right. this, this ground's a little slippery. Be careful. Uh, they didn't add much. We got a 14. If I rerolled, I got a 21. So. Okay, yeah. Well, it, you I. Got, Yes. Not a four minus one. Oh god! As, as a cat, I'm Carter's just, not even actually trying. He's just he's like, like oh, I've made yeah. hand on it. Like, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, you you, you start my feet in, <coughs> dig it into the ground, and push. And uh, yeah, 
Um, you slide the statue out of the way, and it reveals a hole in the floor and a descending ladder that's actually carved out of the stone itself, descending down. Uh-huh. Um, you guys can't see how far the ladder descends, but um, according to the map, it's 45 feet. Infrared on, and I'm walking down the wall. Okay. Oh, yeah, you can walk down the wall. That's true. <laughs> so, yeah, Carter's, walk- talk- Carter's taking the lead. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, you guys uh, descend besides yeah. Carter. I'll go so, last. this says I'm a small monstrosity. How small am I? Um... Oh, like wait, house wait. cat size. Is, oh, is that thing supposed to be small? Because you're not actually small. It's a medium. Yeah. You're, you're, uh, you're panther sized. You're medium. You're panther sized. I'm as big as a panther. Okay. Panthers are medium. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's medium. a small. That's why I was like, am you're I on the small, small end of medium? Small, yeah, you're not an actual cat, I... no. Okay. You're a panther. They're on the medium size of medium. Um. So, yeah, you guys descend down. Hell yeah. I'm super doing it. Um. Actually, retcon, sorry. I missed the thing. Before you guys even start to descend down, uh, the moment the statue is completely has completely revealed this hole in the floor, a uh, chill wind actually suddenly mm. blows down the corridor that you guys are standing in. Um, and it does a kickflip because it it's so chill. <laughs> a cold wind blows through the corridor. And, um, I say hello. It doesn't imme- say hi back. It, it's immediately followed by the sound of something crawling inside the walls. Oh. And then it just scared. suddenly stops. Don't and then the moment it stops, Carter, you hear just laughter in the distance. <laughs> Only? Only Carter hears that? that. No one else does. <laughs> keep us. Just keep swimming. <laughs> now just you guys just send down the ladder, okay, I take okay. it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Prim's just like... What was that? I probably went to go like. Oh, Prem heard like, it too. Yeah. At, well, like everyone heard crawling. the crawling. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh. Everyone heard the crawling in the wind. Yes. Only Carter heard the laughter. Um, I, I put, I, I probably like went to go put my goggles on and like walked down the wall and just like stopped. <laughs> You're like, oh like, shit. Oh, and then continued. <laughs> like, should I be doing this? Oh. Yeah, my the, uh, my ears like perk back. <laughs> And I'm just <laughs> trying to get a snarl. Like, you got, yeah, that, you got yeah. that like uh, mohawk cat scat? Yes. <laughs> like my, my, all my the, hair the is all pushed hair. all the way back. Yeah, here's a question. How is the cat getting down uh, the ladder? Uh, Are you going to like jump on uh, I was going to jump on Sebastian. Yeah, I was going to be like, his armor. Was gonna be like a little like a little scarf on there him. There we go. Like Probably that. like 10 feet from the bottom. That's you adorable. Can just yeah. bail like no problem. Yeah. Well, Come on, I, I mean, yeah, I you can you. bail if you choose. Just for flavor. Yeah, I'll just yeah. chill. Not for mechanical. Like, don't fall. Okay, well, yeah. you're going to chill on the shoulders then? Yes, I Sweet. am. Okay, so Come you on, guys descend down. You. And I'm just purring. Um, <laughs> and you guys find yourself in a 20, a 20 foot by 10 foot chamber, so it's pretty cramped in here. Uh, but there are two ornate uh, coffins standing upward and built into the northern and southern wall. Um, yeah. Two coffins, northern and southern. Mm-hmm. And there are more stairs that descend to the west. Well, check out one of the coffins. Start with one, and then go to the next one, just to check it out. See if there's. You any. open them pretty easily. The remains have been removed. Mm. What are these doing here? This any is carvings orc. on them or anything like that? Um, or? just Mausoleum, like uh, right? like uh, almost like a, a sarcophagus where it's like a image of a person. Okay. This is like image of like orc king and orc queen. Take a picture. Oh, of those. Mm. Sure. yeah, yes. What was that? It was Zarkomand. That was the Zarkomand. Yeah, Zarkomand. Okay. I just want to make sure. So there are uh, stairs, more stairs. Going down. Come on, Percy. I got you. Okay, Let's go. Good. <laughs> so um, these stairs descend 40 more feet uh, before they come and end in a chamber with the impression of a door on the wall. And everything comes to an end here. And this impression of a door carved into the wall is 12 feet tall and it's embedded, um, like I said, into the wall. Um, there is a pedestal topped with a bowl made of black stone and embedded with jade sitting mm-hmm. to the right of this frame, if you will, this door frame. And it's orcish r- an orcish rune carved into the bowl's base. Can I, is that a, maybe one I can decipher? Yeah, you can discern it, and it says blood. <laughs> <laughs> blood feeling. here, please. I won blood. Please, blood here. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll, just, I'll just look up at so Sebastian. I'll, 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 I'll relate it. Uh, so it says blood. I think we know what needs to be done. I'll just anybody in agreement oh. here? Yeah, Prim's I, I like, hand you a dagger. Yeah, Prim's I'll, put like, my, I'll put up my hand. Just close there you go. <laughs> Prim's just like, do, do we have to open it? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> okay. We have some answers. Okay. So, and she shuffles off to the back. <laughs> so she's so got Bastion's a gun ready. Going to reach into one of the the compartments on his armor. Uh-huh. He's going to pull out. 
the orc blade that his mom gave him because he still holds mm. on to that, the old dagger. Mm-hmm. He's going to use that to cut the palm of his, his hand a little bit. Nice. Drop blood into the bowl. That's from Old World. <laughs> That's from Old, old World. It's Old World blade. And, uh, yeah, your blood <laughs> drops into the bowl, and the stone seems to immediately absorb the blood, so the blood just disappears. Oh, and immediately the stone door... Uh, or would be door yeah. becomes an actual door and it sinks into the stone and reveals a chamber beyond. It says, nom, 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 nom. <laughs> <laughs> So, do you guys enter this chamber? Mm-hmm. Yes. So, this chamber is about 50 feet in diameter. It's completely circular and making a ring around the room center are nine four foot tall, kind of skinny, maybe, um, what is that, six inch wide pillars. Uh, each each pillar has like a rounded top with a flat like semicircle cleft into it, as if something's supposed to be put on it. Um, and each pillar has an orcish rune carved into it. I will try to read it if I can, possibly. You do not know what these runes mean, but you can pronounce them. Okay. Um, there are nine of these pillars. Okay. Um, if you want to write down all nine runes, I can give them to you. Sure. All right. Uh, Zael, Morad, Corel, Iom, Erat, Mior, Adius, Mallet, Gru. Each pillar is stained with blood except for the one with the Gru symbol on it. Mm. Oh, because there were no orcs left. Mm-hmm. But now there's an orc here. Are we going to mm-hmm. summon some BS right now? <laughs> Possibly. This oh, is yeah. some sort also, of summoning ritual, also, isn't it? Mm-hmm. the entire floor mm-hmm. sprawling with symbols and patterns. Confusing and dizzying every time you guys try and focus on oh. the symbols. Oh. Uh, and this script is not in orcish. This script is in something no one here recognizes. And that's on the floor, On you the said. floor, yeah. Mm. I'll probably giggle and like look down I and like, like make that. it make it yeah. uh, nauseate me a little bit and like <laughs> yeah <laughs> uh, yeah my uh, it's pretty clear what needs to go on in here uh, the and hair is sticking up on me again yeah what what the consequences of that will be I do not know but I am prepared for anything mm. and right wing Carter says that everyone give me a perception check yes. There's an eyeball on the ceiling. We use up. We use uh, up top C. Fourteen. To look up. <laughs> to look up. Seven, uh, Fourteen. Seventeen. Seven. Seven. Eight. But I do have the alert feet, so I cannot be. I do. Have I se- understand. Yep, yep. I understand what that means. <laughs> took, um, it, took it for a reason. So where are you standing in the room? Or are each of you like standing at a different? Ooh, I, was, I, I think I was, I was the walking middle. around. Yeah, to you the were walking pillars, around. So I don't know where I ended up. At. Uh, I think we ended on Gru, so we'll say okay. you're at the Gru. Yeah. I was looking at the thing on the floor. Okay, like towards the center, towards the right. Like towards where, the center, I towards guess. Towards the center, okay. I probably would have walked with, with him. him. Yeah. Okay, and Prim and Vicky are going to be near the entrance. Mm-hmm. Um, you guys hear a kind of a slurping sound from above, Ugh. and you guys look up, but no one can see through the darkness. Cause there's, Except for it, me. Well, you can see infrared. Do you turn on your goggles? Uh, if I look up, if I, it would be like after the fact. Like, if I look yeah. up and I can't see through, I'll pop them on. Okay. Yeah, we'll say, like, you guys hear the slurp and you look up, you pop them on. And you you don't see something hot. You see the opposite. Something amorphous and cold is slurping and burbling up there. Mm. And immediately after you see it, it drops down. Everyone roll initiative. Fuck. Woo. Fuck. What sort of eldritch horrors have we unleashed? <laughs> That's hilarious. Twelve. Where's my big die? It's, it's right f- under the book. Yeah. It is. All right, big die for the big guy. Love you, big die. Uh, also, prim, prim crit failed, and Victoria didn't no. do much better. I got a four. Um, it <laughs> get better than a four. <laughs> I, I got a six. twelve. Oh gosh, you guys. Yeah, it was a pretty low because mm-hmm. my base roll was a six. Um, I'm surprised at what's so going on. So Carter, yeah. you got mm-hmm. twelve. Carter mm-hmm. does go first. I will Holy say wow. that. Wow. I'm the best. Um, I'm the best. I didn't get, by I didn't get like jelloed thing. up right now by cold pudding. Uh, it landed next to you. Dope. Um, who, any, who got better than um, an eight? Nope. Victoria, it is. 
Who got next best? Six. Sebastian. Um, then Percy. Four. And then Prim Crit Film. Okay, so let's describe this scene. So this thing drops down, and it, it it looks like this ooze made of red, viscous material. And to make it more horrifying is every few seconds or so, the um, impression of a face, like, emerges here and there uh, around the wall with different faces, yeah. and they let out, like, bubbling screams. It's envy. And each face <laughs> looks... Like like one face looks like a human, but then another face looks like a dwarf kind of face, and then oh, another no. face looks like a tiefling. It and is envy. Yeah. So yeah, let's do this. Uh, Carter, you're up first. Time to kill some old DNA stuff. Um, <laughs> Gain sentience. I'm gonna back up a lot, like as much as I can. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm gonna hex the thing, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and I'm gonna cast level three witch bolt. Ooh. Um, so, I'm making a ranged spell attack against a creature that I can see right now. New mm-hmm. spell. Um, New spell. Yeah, okay, go ahead. It is 24. Uh, or, yeah, sorry, it's 25. Yeah, to AC? That yeah, yeah, totally. Okay, I'm going to roll uh, 3d12 of lightning damage against you. Okay. Do you need D12s or just gonna roll yours? Freeling, can I have Freeland's D12s? Sure. You want your metal D12s? Metals. They match my the boys. D12s. Boys, big boys. Ooh, big meaty boys. Plus the D6. This is gonna be fun. Oh, four dice combined for okay. damage. Okay. Uh, ten, six, and seven. Sixteen, twenty-three. Uh, it's twenty-three. Twenty-six. Damn, 26 lightning, damage. Lightning yeah. damage. Yeah, you it crackles and it like it really uh, hits is, this thing hard. What does that look like? Uh, Unlimited <laughs> <laughs> I look like And Palpatine. as you do it, like the faces start appearing like faster and screaming faster okay. Okay, as the electricity striking them. Can we call me 20 feet away? Uh, oh yeah, sure, sure. Oh, that's fair. Um, I, might do it I mean, it's coming for your ass right now, but. Mm-hmm, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah it doesn't matter. I just didn't want it to get like it. too far from me. Okay. Right. So it's going to move towards Carter now, uh, since that's the thing hurting it, and it is going to swing at you with a pseudopod. Oh God. So that is a twenty-one AC. Mm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, so mm-hmm. you are going to take. Um, these bones. You're gonna take. It's gonna get smacked. Seven bludgeoning damage. Ah. Uh, and you're going to take nine, eleven. Oh my god. Twenty-two necrotic damage. And it's going to gain twenty-two temporary HP as it drains life from your body. I hate it. it. Fuck. Okay, so I have fifty-seven. So I took twelve bludge. Uh huh. And twenty-two. And deuce, deuce. Cool. And that's its turn. So Carter's next up bloody. is Victoria, who's like, what the fuck? And going to attack it with her pistol. Um, She crit. She fucking crit. Ooh, yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. So it's 46. She has to crit to do stuff. Yeah, seriously. Whoa. Oh, only ones and twos. Oh. Um, <laughs> <laughs> two, four, six, plus four. She does 10 laser damage to it. Carter doesn't drop the witch bolt, but he's still like, mm. <laughs> <Still looks better. laughs> Next up is uh, Sebastian. First, first time for this, he's gonna uh, point his arm out. Mm-hmm. His palm's gonna light up, and his fingers gonna retract into his wrist, and he's like, letting out a oh blast. Oh okay. Yeah, sure, yes. sure, sure. sure. So, so yeah, his, his fingers and everything just kind of roll into his his, his yeah. wrist. You're like, what the fuck is that? Holy <laughs> shit! So, uh, it has to make a dexterity save. <laughs> it's got a negative two. It's a DC 13. All right, so it just, it needs to roll a 15 or better. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I oh, rolled a 16. No, ah, it still takes uh, half damage. Okay. So God it's damn. three. The ooze was like, no. It was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Carter's like, oh. <laughs> so it's three D6, then I'll take that in half, and it's radiant damage. Okay, cool. So I don't know if that makes a difference or, or not. Harm it. 14, so 7 damage. Okay. 7 radiant damage. Man, that temp HP is beast that you guys are going to have to tear through. Yeah. He still has some. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. I said he, it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, anything they, else? They, <laughs> they indeed. <laughs> no, I Do you want to move? That's good. How far is it? Because it's... It's um, they moved Carter. towards Carter, so I, I picture Carter. Uh, be like, I, I let, went to the side. We were all yeah. like in a line, yeah, like through the middle of the room. Yeah, yeah. I went off to the side. So I mean, it's within twenty feet of you. I definitely went to the left side. <laughs> I, I, I'd move up on it. Okay, cool. You moved okay, up cool. on it. Uh, next up is uh, Percy. Okay, um, I was close to him, so if I have forty feet, can I get to it? Oh uh, yeah, yeah. yeah? I think everyone could get to everyone in this room. I will uh, close the gap and unleash upon it a multi-attack oh. with a bite and a claw. Oh, shit. Um, you're going to take a d10 of damage Why as don't? you touch the blood. Oh, fuck. Which blood? You take nine damage. It's blood? It, it, it oh. is blood. It is blood. Uh, you take nine necrotic damage and it gains nine more HP. Tamp HP, but continue with your attack. This is the blood of the eight. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, so this is uh, 15 to hit. That hits. Dope. And, oh, Jesus. Let me roll that again because it, oh, it doesn't matter. 10 to hit was the second one. Uh, it hits. What the fuck? Yeah, pots. The goop has low AC. So that is max damage. 17 for the first. <laughs> that was pretty good. 17 piercing. Okay, and, so you find a punch through the temporary, so. And then a um, D10. Nine, da, Jesus, and then fourteen slashing for the second hit. Oh, it resists slashing, so okay. cut that in half. Uh, so seventeen. Oh. So you said fourteen, so it's seven. Yeah, right? seven. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, it's letting out screams as slash, it's taking slash. damage. It's really horrific sounding. Uh, um, yeah, I don't like it. My hair is all bristled up. Yeah. <laughs> Prim's turn, and she's going to fire a laser. She misses. She rolled a two. I think she's really shook right now. Uh, like really, yeah. really shook right yeah. now. Yeah. Um, I'm Carter, you're shook. up. All right, I'm gonna use my action to just I auto do the witch bolt. To okay. It, so. Does it do three d six each time? It's gonna do three d twelve each time because it casts at a level three. Oh, I see. I yeah. See. So wow. it's gonna do three d twelve plus impressive. the hex. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Oh, and you don't have to roll to attack. Nope. Uh, uh, just, I think I auto get it's it continuous because I got it the first time. That's really goddamn powerful. Yeah. So it hits me and I'm just like laughing. Yeah. Like I don't give a fuck. Yeah. I'm gonna fucking kill this guy. Isn't um, it as a bonus action you can make it happen, or is it an action? No, I think time? I use my action. Spell attack on a hit. D twelves duration on each of your turns for the duration you can use your action, action to deal okay. gotcha. the damage to the target automatically. Gotcha. Spell ends if I use my action to do anything else. Mm-hmm. So I rolled the damage mm-hmm. just I now, see, see. and you, I got, got ten plus so seventeen plus six. I did like twenty three to it again. Twenty three. Yeah, nice. it's like screaming, like just like it's going crazy now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. You know. ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, and now it's its turn. It's still up against you, so it's gonna hit you again. It's treason, then. <laughs> <laughs> um, it is gonna come at you with a pseudopod. It's going to do 15 AC. Oh. Okay. Um, and it's going to do... Uh-oh. Oh, no. Two plus three. That's five bludgeoning damage. Jokey. And then... That necro. Can I get two D10s thing. from you guys? Nope. I would rather not contribute to the... You have a whole tray of D10s right there, bro. Oh, God. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I'm so used so to many asking. Dice like, so many there. dice right there. Um, eight plus... Eight plus nine. Ah, <laughs> uh, Carter's down. He's so down. that's twenty-seven. It gains twenty-seven temp HP. No, I can only gain eighteen because that's all I have. No, no, but it still gains that because it still does that damage to you. Like you still take that damage even though there's no negative. Does that make sense? Oh, like, but it didn't. Okay, sure. Yeah. Whatever. It doesn't make sense that it can take life I don't have. That's fine. <laughs> I mean, because you're not dead. You, like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like, if you were to take. It's fine equal to maximum of your HP, then you would be dead and it would be able to take any more. Can't say shit about it, I'm dead. Okay, <laughs> so Carter's down. Next up is Baby Victoria, zero. who is like, oh shit, Carter's down. She's never seen one of you guys drop, I don't think. I, mean, I maybe, died laughing. Maybe Sebastian, but Sebastian never really dropped. Yeah. Sebastian always and just dropped and got back up immediately. Yeah, um, she's never So witnessed. she's gonna open fire. <laughs> She Our hits. healer is not going to ah! heal. Cool. Oh, wait. Yeah, she can heal. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I yeah, no, no. To... Good move. Good move. <laughs> She's going to cast Cure Wounds on you, which is uh, off the top of my head. I a, believe it's a D8 D8. plus whatever the nah, she can do it at a second. Mod. She can do it at a second level. Yeah, please. So four. Heal boy. Plus four is eight plus her wisdom mod. We'll say is three. So 11. You're up with 11. Hey. Okay. Sebastian, He's you're a... up. 
Saves me from doing it. <laughs> so I was, I was, gonna was I it. able to tell that it resisted slashing damage? Um, yes. Okay, and my axe would be slashing, because I have it listed as energy, but I don't know if it does energy damage or slashing damage. Um, it does slashing damage. Okay. What about your big meaty club? Yeah. I don't know if we resist that too. You have a giant club. Yeah, I'm going to try, try the giant, giant club. Yeah, so go for I'm it. So two-handed, so I don't know go for it. what the damage is on that, but we'll roll to see if we um, hit. Yeah, it's going to be, um, it's two-handed, it's going to be a d12. That's a 20 total. Oh yeah, yeah, twenty. Twenty. Um, All right, D12. twelve. I need my D twelve back, please. Did you give me? A no, no Brian has it. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm dead. Here you go. By the way, here are <laughs> your D tens back. Um, oh. <laughs> I have D tens over here. This is ridiculous. Thank you. <laughs> so, D12. so yeah, D twelve. Ooh, that's gonna be a fourteen. Uh, yeah, fourteen damage. Nice. So it now only has fourteen temp HP. Cool. Fast. <laughs> uh, next up is uh, Percy. Give it to bite attack, claw attack. Don't you have a side beam attack? I do. Okay. I wasn't gonna use it. Yeah, I'll okay. right up on him. Uh, but yeah, if you uh, if you attack it physically again, you're gonna take auto d10. And it's gonna heal it. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, only seven this time, and it has more than seven temp, so it doesn't really heal. Oh. Okay. It's not actually healing. It's temporary yeah. HP. So 17 for the first hit. Uh, that hits. And uh, 15 for the second. Uh, that also hits. So that's three, seven, uh, 12 for the first hit. Okay. And um, this is 11 slashing, so five for the um, second. Five, okay, so five, so. Oh man, it's it keeps being almost a death store and then it heals back up, it's hilarious. Uh, it's, first, it's Prim's turn. She might be able to kill this thing. Kill that shit, Prim, but I'm a cat, so meow. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, she fails. She rolls oh. a five plus four is nine. Oh, so her. she's too shook. Next up is Carter. Um, from the floor, I get up. No, right. I just look at the, I just look at this thing like every face I've seen is filthy. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I cast vicious mockery. So oh, you, nice. You nice, make nice. a wisdom saving throw. Um, okay. <laughs> it has a negative one to this, and it also fails because it's shook. Uh, nine. I rolled a nine. You fail. Nice. Take. Two damage. <laughs> two psychic damage, okay. And you have disadvantage on your next attack. Oh, nice. Um, I Clutch. will run away. Can I do that without triggering? It's up against you, up a wall. Uh, against the wall. Mm. It's And it's being pinned down by the three other. Would it's, everyone else by Sebastian. And, would uh, its opportunity Percy. attack be a disadvantage? <laughs> it would have disadvantage. <laughs> it would be, yeah. I'm going to run away. <laughs> okay, cool. Up the wall. So I'll do the up two. the wall? Nice. Oh, that's up the bad. wall. Yeah, yeah that's, that's pretty sweet. Where, um, where he was. So with yeah. disadvantage, it misses with an eight. Hey! Yay. Run away! <laughs> I'm out of here! <laughs> so Carter goes running up the wall. Next up is... Uh, Lay the filthy face. This thing. <laughs> um, it's going after Percy now. Because sure. it's the other thing that's hurting it. With... Okay. <laughs> I'm not going to count that. <laughs> it was a nat one, though. It was a seven. Oh. Um, so 18 plus five, it, it, it hits. hits. <laughs> um, so you're going to take uh, eight bludgeoning damage, and then it's going to Does deal. it heal? It's about to. As Fuck. soon as I can dig these D10s out of this tray. <laughs> that is a lot of D10s. That's yeah, exactly so, uh, what I thought six, as well. Six, 12 plus nine is uh, 21. Uh, necrotic damage, and it now it's 21 temp. <laughs> is this cool. a pudding? It is a blood ooze. That's a blood ooze. Okay, it's an ooze. Next up is Victoria, who's going to attack. Oh, Sorry, this is the last time I hate involve NPCs in a fight. Uh, she hits. Kill it. Even though it healed all she that She did shit. two damage. No, she did five damage. Yes. Uh, okay, next up is a Sebastian. All right. Let's swing the club. I forgot to actually get two attacks. I forgot to oh, take the yeah. second one last time, but we'll do two this time. You would have killed it, too. Uh, you know, <laughs> I, was after, I was like, I can't say it after the fact. It was my <laughs> that's bad. All right, that's all right, that's all right. 15 on the first one. It's... I crit on the second one. Oh, yes! So just for good crit. measure, I'm going to do a Divine Smite on the crit. You try, but you can't through the club. Oh, shit. Yeah, There's oh. Uh, so this weapon is unholy. <gasps> You've been touching it all day. <laughs> You've been loving it all day. But, no worries. Okay. but you do crit. So, so that, curse <laughs> that was a great gasp, guys. 
So the first one did 17 damage. Oh, buddy, yeah. yeah it's, uh, it has no more temp, that's for sure. And then... So I get three D12s in. Mm-hmm. Or, mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Give me all that damage. Oh, that's a one. Oh, no. Oh, that's, that's a one, one too. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Better. Y'all gotta shake your dice before you throw them. Your hand a little bit. Just so that's a uh, thirteen. Is that is that it? Is that all your damage that you're doing? No, no, no the second hit. Yeah, so that's it. That's yeah. the last of it. Okay, yeah, you I kill think. this thing. Hey. And I just picture you like overhead swinging, oh, come down with yeah. the giant. I'm like club, jumping up and, and like, you splatter <laughs> it. It just fuck this thing splatters and then it melts into a pool of blood that then begins to evaporate. Dope. Cold blood. Okay. Gone okay. through this world. Thank God. So the back from whence it came. Victoria's just like, let's get the fuck out of here. I need a short rest so bad, baby. I'm not resting in here. Okay. <laughs> Do we, uh, what, uh, what about oh, the last I'm pillar? Do we, we try it? I'll change back. Okay. To Percy. That was wild as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've been a cat this whole time, so I haven't really been able to participate in, you know, the conversation. Uh, what body else? body language says a lot. Yeah, 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 it's true, it's true. Are you okay, Carter? You got kind of fucked up? I'm so tired. Yeah? I'm so tired, too, God. Yeah, maybe we'll get a short rest soon here, but what else do we... So he wasn't able to do any inspect that Gru statue. We weren't able to do anything. Yeah, because yeah. You guys got interrupted. Ooh, you yeah. guys so can continue your investigation. Okay. okay. Put your blood on so, the Gru. Yeah, let's so keep. So we'll go take a look at Gru. Yeah. Check it mm-hmm. out and inspect it. So mm-hmm. I don't know if you want me to roll. Seb- or... Sebastian, you are you, the uh, Give me um, history checks. History checks. History checks? All of you. History. If you're all in, in, included in this investigation. How does an eight do, William? Uh, not good. Oh. Not good at all. Okay. What about a... Shucks. Two. <laughs> Two? Two. No. Can we add our scores to no. I got a 10. Oh, so. gosh. Never mind. Ah, uh, D20s combined equal a decent okay. roll. Well, you can, continue with, you can continue with your investigation checks if you wish. Yes. yes. So now we're investigating yes. now. I was just trying to see if you could discern something historically speaking. 17. <laughs> I am not a history. I rolled person. another three. Um, <laughs> How's a 10 do you for? Why is Carter a pirate? No, <laughs> the, the answer is no. I got um, a nine, so. Okay, so Percy, you're looking at this and you're realizing, oh, okay, obviously sacrificial chamber. Yeah, I think yeah. everyone could discern that. Mm. It's these uh, pillars with the cleft in it. The cleft isn't to put something on. Well, I mean, it is. It's they literally kneel people down on their knees and put their skulls. Uh, they fit their chins right into this cleft, and, then they and they're swoosh. smashing their fucking heads against these mm, pillars. Sorry, buddy. Mm. Not happening. <laughs> mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. So this is, you know, I will convey that this is like a sacrificial chamber, and they put people's faces on these and then like smash their brains in. So we can't do that to you, my what guy. What the fuck? I don't know. This is a bad place. Um, Sorry, I got 23. Investigate. Did oh. you really? Yeah. <laughs> well, then, you know then Carter, Carter <laughs> comes to the same conclusion. I like the idea of like Percy saying it. Yeah. Like right after she, she says it, you say it too. You're like, oh, God damn it. <laughs> she got it. Uh, what do we... Is there a way to get blood out of you? Whoa. Like not blowing your brains out? Or is it like... Well, that's the thing is we, we, don't, like we don't know if it just needs fluid. a little bit of blood or if we could try like, using that organic matter that... I mean, Carter it looks like it needs a lot of blood. Ooh, that's true. I don't want to give my orc goop to this. This is a beast of a machine. This is where the orc goop is supposed to go, though. Do you think so? They would have used it here if it worked like that. That's fair. That's fair. I think we, we got yours. in here, did they? I don't think we want to... This is Victoria speaking. I don't think we want to do whatever the hell this room's made to do. No, like, yeah. You're going to summon... So. This is a summoning ritual of some sort. I think Carter would, like, understand. I think it is a summoning ritual, right? right. Like, I'm just we... making the assumption, like... You can give me Arcana a, check. Uh, sure. This is just a character choice I think I'm making. Like, yeah. This is for summoning bullshit garbage. A six. Uh, Eleven. Yeah, you're, you're you it's know. obvious. You know that, what it yeah, is. Like, yeah, you know what it is. Everybody knows. So the other <laughs> Light, lights and candles. Get the ambiance going. You'll, Do we you'll feel the, the presence of something unholy Ooh. coming. <laughs> you will. Can we? Can we destroy it? Do we want to take out a column? It's been chilling for like a long time. It looks like. But now they have an orc in their midst. Who do? There's nobody here. I mean, he's why do you think they're looking for me? They have to come here. Oh, I don't a, want my head smashing <laughs> on this <laughs> shit. I want to fucking destroy it. I mean, that's I fair. That's I'm fair. destroying you it. Destroy what? The, the you can't. Call, no, you can't. Everything's made out of black stone that cannot be destroyed. 
Ooh, even with his uh, magic mallet? Yeah, what's what yeah, even with his magic mallet. Um if you remember what Zahn was saying, like none of their tools, none of their yeah. weapons were able to damage the stone and open the chamber. So we don't want to open the chamber. The so chamber's we, open. You guys are in the chamber. Yeah, we're in Oh, this was the chamber we yeah, needed to be in. Gotcha, 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 yeah, plot armor. <laughs> <laughs> plot armor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Victoria's oh like, God. okay, I'm leaving. Like, <laughs> this is way too much. And what the fuck even was that? Yeah, I have no idea. It was like the blood of the. It was the blood of the innocent. The fallen, what are you, yeah. Are you some yeah. amateur? You've been flying around space for how long? You've never seen the blood of the innocent coagulate into a singular form and attack people? <laughs> given, given sentience Standard and malice? stuff, girl. Standard stuff. Okay, what are you guys doing now? Yeah, this place seems pretty Let's get out of here and take a shit. Can I go to sleep or something? Shit. Let's get out of this room so I can sit down. Stop okay. listening to this crying. So you guys, I take it head back. Yes. A little bit. All right. Without incident, you guys make it back to the laboratory. Carter seems like he really wants to short rest. Are you going to short rest once I you I want to short rest in Dr. Zahn's office so bad. Is that okay. all right yeah, with sure. you? Yeah, okay. sure. Okay. Sebastian, I mean, I know we left... Did you have any sort of... I just feel like there's more. There has to be more. It does seem weird that we went through all that trouble and didn't do anything with... Well, you guys guys did get one other lead that ties into the dossier lead as well. Explain. (laughs) (laughs) Um... Everyone just give me an intelligence check. Whoever wins this contest gets gets the prize. Us as as players? Because I got a seven. How's it? How's a ten for you, Will? Well, they might win. So. I got a two. <laughs> okay, Carter wins. So, Carter, Arr. you connect the dots, and you remember that the Sahandrian, which was the ship that uh, mm. Denethar's father was on, went down yes. in the Manzacorian system. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, in the conference call that Jan- that uh, Anadur had with Zahn, he told Zahn that when he was done at this laboratory, he needed to immediately report to Manzacor mm-hmm. uh, because that's where they, he was going to put stuff in... Um, I did in, get that name. In motion to build the Egress article. Yeah, so like uh, the Manzacor is our next destination. That's me. the one thing you have right now. Um, yeah. You might be able to discern more later. But you guys take a short rest? Yeah. Sure. Okay, so go ahead. Do it. Patch yourselves up. Do, do your thing. Spell slots. Um, oh, I got all my hit die back. I got my wild shape back. from Because I only used one before anyway. So I'm gonna, I've got 11 HP. I'm going to roll all my hit die. <laughs> That's 10. That's 21. You also have that dope medical injector. Yeah, but I got hit die for free. Oh, yeah. That's true. That's why it's, it's, oh, you want to just keep witch bolting. That's why. It's like That's why you didn't use your injector. It's true. Yeah, because if I do anything else, I die. I, my witch that's bolt That's a drops. really good move for you to have, though. That witch On a bolt single thing. boss like that, yeah. that was my... I was like, I can't wait to do this. And yeah. I was like, we'll probably get one like, in this you one. You definitely yeah. took out most of its HP, I mm-hmm. think. Yeah, it's a powerful spell. It had three. 100 or so HP. When you were done with it, it was basically barely fighting back yeah. in the 30s the whole time. Yeah, this Grimalkin uh, is strong. Yeah. Also. Yeah. Well, I knew, I wanted to give you something stronger because his other strong. performance were pretty weak. Are you guys uh, wrapping up your short rest? What's um, up? Real What's quick. Up? I mean, because I'm really i I'm good. I don't think I really need to take a short yeah. rest. While they were short resting, I want to see if I can collect the orc skeleton and put it back into one of the sarcophagus. Sure. And back yeah. in there. Totally. Stop. You do it. I do that. Yeah, nothing stops you. And then I take the, the scrolls with me. Yeah. Okay, you got the scrolls. Um. So, yeah, you take the skeleton back. When you come back off the bridge and into the, like, the top dome area, you're yeah. one floor above these two and the rest of your party. There's a large crash in the glass above you. Oh, shit. And you look up, and Gil comes crashing down onto the oh, floor. Oh, shit. And he's just like, oh. Gil, and, what, and then, Gil, what and, happened? And, and We're going to get attacked like, by Now's not right a good now. time. Yeah, and then immediately, here. like, this giant insectile <laughs> monstrosity <laughs> with wings, like, roars into the laboratory and comes down and descends upon you guys and everyone roll initiative. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I rolled all my hit die, God, and I'm again. five off of full. <laughs> um, okay, for sure, for sure. As the spider drake des- uh, descends. Now, this thing She's is red and black. So it's dumb. It's uh, segmented. It's got bat wings, but everything else about it is, like, spider-like, except mm. for it has, a, a like, a lizard tail. Dumb. And its dragonishly shaped head has eight eyes. That's the, the query. <laughs> dope, 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 dope. Spider what? Spider drake. Um, spider drake got a 13. Uh, spider drake. Gil spider got a drake. 18. Mm-hmm. Anyone I'm, beat an 18? Nope. Me. A 22. Oh, nice. Okay, Carter. I'm sorry, but Prim and Victoria are just going to stay downstairs. 
Sure. That's fair. That's fair. Um, they're talking things out right now. They're like, yeah, and like, <laughs> they're not great in a fight, and that sounds serious. So, <laughs> like, we should stay safe down here. <laughs> yeah. Um, like, that guy want, killed that lizard folk. That dude wants to activate the blood ritual. That one changes into a cat now. <laughs> Let's just hang out. Let's just hang out. Let's just chill for a little How bit. How are you doing? It's the cutest um, form. Did anyone be a. Um, I got a five, just to let you know. So I'm probably I got last. a four. Oh, shit. So I'm oh, gosh. Okay. <laughs> five, four, and 22. Yeah, yeah the best. Yeah, yeah. Uh, who, who was the five? I was. Okay. Sebastian. That bastard. Okay. <laughs> um, big problem for you two is you guys are downstairs. So it's going to take you a whole turn to get upstairs. But Fuck. one of you is ranged, so there's that. All right. So um, first up is Carter. So I'm, you, you I'm hear, one of the ones downstairs. Yeah, you hear a crash and a roar from upstairs, and you hear probably Gil and, and uh, Sebastian yelling. <laughs> Neat. Spider Drake's here, guys. <laughs> Spider Drake. Percy, Carter. Spider Drake. Come on, boy. What does 30 feet get me in the Damn, scenario? Uh, I'll get you right up the stairs and like into the room, but nowhere near anybody. Where? Do, how? What's the distance between me um, and the creature? You and the creature? Oh, actually, you're pretty close. 15 feet. It's cramped up here. I'll say that much. All right, doing it again. <laughs> Lightning. Um, bonus, ac <laughs> bonus action hex. I really like this power. <laughs> it's hilarious. Uh, Witch Bolt. Um, yeah, spell attack. 17 plus 7 going to do it for you, bud? Um, 24. Yes. Uh, yes. Okay, here we go with the D12s. Can it, somebody hook it up? Give it some unlimited power. Just so you guys uh, battle ones. remember, you guys do have your suits on. The... Um, the blood ooze oh. didn't cause any like suit damage really. Like there was no piercing or damage to to yeah, fuck just with the suit. just just smacking us with its face pods. <laughs> yeah, this and, uh, the deepling face like whack. Yeah, and it's it was like it was sucking life force out of you with unholy powers. Um, but miasma is now bleeding into this laboratory uh -oh. from from the ceiling. Unlimited bar. Uh, okay, uh, we have to roll to. Oh yeah, you hit. Yeah. I did hit. So sixteen, eighteen. Uh, 21 damage. Uh, yeah, yeah. You, uh, it, it roars. <laughs> <laughs> In anger. It's really pissed. Ow! <laughs> um, Gil, like that. Why all the monsters in your world sound like Pee Wee Herman? <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh, um, oh. Gil pulls out two Aether Blades and he goes at it. Mm -hmm. Do it, Gil. <laughs> he fails. So oh, he rolled Gil. a four and a two. Cool, uh, cool. It's the Spider Drake's turn, and, uh, the first thing it's gonna do is, um... Can someone look up the restrained status effect really quickly? Because I think it does a thing, but I'm not sure it does it's a thing. It's not good. Yeah. Restrained, I think, is like if it It completely hits. stops you from doing shit, right? Yeah. That's what I think. And I think if it hits, it's like an auto crit against you. Yeah, it I'm completely makes sure. you helpless. So it's going to look at Carter, and it's going to like... It's... Speed becomes zero. Can't benefit from any bonus to its speed. Attack rolls against the creature have advantage. Mm, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. And the creature's attack rolls have disadvantage. The creature has... Well, that's if you restrain something. Mm -hmm. uh, the creature has disadvantage on deck saves. So you cannot... You attack at disadvantage. It has advantage on you. And you can't make deck saves. And you can't move. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So um, what happens with your spell then if you can't move? I mean, uh, I'm good it's, it's at this point. Based. I just, uh, it's it's gonna auto hit every time after this. But no, but is, my point is, it's like, concentration. So if I take damage, I have to roll against the damage. No, but my point is, like, don't you need to be able to like move your hands? Isn't it somatic? I just need to take an action, and it's verbal, somatic, or material, or VSM are the components. So I can okay. do, I can but, just do it. Okay. Yeah, so if I, I get restrained, it doesn't matter because I don't need to roll attack rolls on it anymore. I'm locked in, pretty much. Okay. But um, you, uh, you can damage me to hit me out of it, pretty much. Right. Well, okay. It's going to do something else then. It's going to, uh, its glands underneath its chin are going to expand, and it's going to breathe out poison breath directly at Carter. Oh, shit. So, Carter, make a constitution saving throw. Yes. Plus, plus three. Ooh, nice. So, plus three. So, uh, con, 14 plus three, 17. All right. So, you succeed, yes. and you only Thanks, take... Thanks, Sebastian. That plus three. You only though. take 3d12 poison damage instead of 60. Oh, good. Damn. That's good. That's so glorious. I'm glad I used every hit die I have. To live. So that's 12, plus 8 is 20, plus 10 is 30. You take 30 poison damage, Shit. and you are poisoned. I've taken so much damage this this game. Is oh that, my god. Is that half that's on a recharge. That? that was half of it. I just, I, it was half, but I also rolled a 10 and a 12. Oh. And an eight. Yeah. 
fuck. <clears throat> you just rolled Holy half the die. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Um, and that's its turn. That's nice. Next up is Sebastian. Well, shit. I know what I'm doing shit. next turn. Delilah. <laughs> <laughs> that's on a recharge, though, so who knows when I will be able to do it again. All right. I wanted, I'm want. i actually going to use... No, I'm going to use my axe here on this time. Two axe wings at it. Yeah. That's a crit miss. Cool. Oh, actually, and then I take... Well, my arm gets fucked up. <gasps> oh, yeah, your arm. This is the first time this has yeah. happened. So now it goes down to, like, normal. Now you have normal arm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Gotta repair your arm. Uh, and that's gonna be 16 to hit. Oh, uh, yeah, that hits. Okay. It's gonna be, uh, 10 damage. Okay. Mm. That's all I got right now. No smite, no nothing like that. You yeah. are so conservative with your smites, I, I don't even begin to understand it. <laughs> this is a giant yeah. spider dragon. <laughs> yeah, this cat wants it like dead or alive, I'm pretty do, sure. Do, He's like uh, trying to stab it. <laughs> it's gonna kill him. It's gonna kill us. It's gonna kill you, definitely. It's gonna kill me, but like that's additional <laughs> time to get another shot. That on nice, it. nice. Yeah. You've brought it below hundred HP. Hey. <laughs> Next up is Percy. Uh, You're downstairs. I'm downstairs. Yeah. So I have 30. Mm -hmm. So I'll run. Could I get to the doorway like how Carter uh, was? Yeah, you get there and Carter's like sick and like vomiting and you can smell the poison in the air. I'm but like, like vomit in my suit and I'm just like, ah! <laughs> 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 it's horrifying. Oh no. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'll be downstairs, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna leave. Percy just ugh, backs Ooh, out. <laughs> gross. What is uh? What is the poison effect? Like, I, dear God, I want fat art of that. Of <laughs> just that like, scene. ugh, oh, God. God. <laughs> what does poison mean as far as a? It's a status effect. Status that's effect. how much you look up. You I got it. I, I got them all a chart. A poison creature has disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks. Okay, cool. That's not good for you to have. Well, right? actually, he's okay. I don't just need to guess. Yeah, lightning. he's casting shit, right? Yeah, that's it's hilarious. It's just a continuous every turn thing. <laughs> okay, I'll um, I will cast frostbite my cantrip. Okay. So it's a con saving throw. Oh, okay. it has to beat fifteen. As a plus three to Constitution. Cool. Hopefully it'll be. Do I fit. have a. Oh, it's got a plus seven saving throw to Constitution. Holy shit. Fuck. It's a dragon, so dragons get shit. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't um, have done 15 that. 15 plus seven. Okay, yeah, no, garbage. Uh, and then I will. Um, I'll scan it. Okay, cool. Scan. And then. Um, next turn, you get the info, right? Next turn, I get the info. I can't really do anything else, so I, I'm um, just sitting here being grossed out. <laughs> Carter, it's your card. Am I supposed to roll concentration on that one? I think I am. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. You, you took fat damage. I took so, 30, yeah. so I take half. I, I have to beat 15. Yeah. Constitu constitution. I fail it, I think. Okay. Lightning drops. It? Okay. Uh, it was a six plus my. Plus two plus. Or plus whatever you have, plus three. So. Is it oh, a saving throw? From him. From, uh, you yeah, you get a bonus three, from, yeah. uh, it is a saving from the throw, paladin. Yeah. So it's con save? Uh, con save. Yeah. So eight plus three, it's 11. Ah, do not still fails. Yeah. yeah. Um, so that's fine. Lightning I'm just going gone. to cool. Eldritch Blast it and move to safety. Yeah. So now I have disadvantage on attack? Yes. Unless someone cures you of the poison. Fine. Okay, my first one was uh, 12. Um... That misses. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <Stacked> out there <laughs> for like, I, was, I just spaced out. Yeah, I was like, I, my I mind went blank. It. I saw it happen. Uh, ten. Uh, that misses. Okay. Uh oh. I hunker. You hunker down. <laughs> Next up is Gil. He's gonna try, and he's actually gonna move to get in the way. He sees that Carter, uh, is going down, and Got he's like, oh shit. Up. And so yeah. like, he does like a, a tumble, and avoids the opportunity attack, and gets in between Carter and the, the Drake. Hey. He double attack. Um, that is a 15 which misses, but a 16 that hits. Nope. So he will do. Oops, sorry. Nine, nine ether damage, if you will. I like it. And um, that's his turn. Next up is the Spider Drake, who is. You did a lot of damage to it, didn't you? Did some <clears throat> some damage to it. Yeah. So it is going to. It's um. Abdomen is going to kind of curl underneath it, oh, and no. you see that it has a, a web spinner at the end, and it's going to <laughs> spit a big web thing at you. Oh, so I need uh, this is a, this is probably still going to miss because your AC is just so goddamn extraordinary. 
but we'll see mm -hmm. what happens. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I miss. Hey, so the web just <laughs> flies by your head. Goddamn. Um, does it have anything else? Ugh, I wasted its turn. Oh well, that would have been cool. Next up go. is Sebastian. All right, Carter, Carter, let me come help you. Uh, I can uh, help him next turn if you want to hurt him. Yeah, maybe keep hurting because Percy doesn't have a lot to do. Okay. It doesn't look like. Yeah. All right. It's on the floor. This spider drake. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just curious. All right. I'll take two swipes at it then. Yeah, go for it. Swaps. That's gonna be a miss. That's gonna be a hit. That's a twenty-two. Noise. Yeah. Noise. And then I'll, I'll wheel do another divine smite for you guys. Oh, Please it's gonna do. try and recharge its breath. Can you do that. First? It does not. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see here. <laughs> That's so nine for that, and then let me roll my divine smite. Roll that shit. Hit that shit. Hit that shit. 24 total. <laughs> oh, oh, gosh, fuck. yeah. You start tearing into this thing. <laughs> and Gil's like, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, 24, you said? Yeah. Uh, Glad I brought you along. <laughs> Good show, Matt. <laughs> Yes. And um, now it's Percy's turn. And, oh, you're going to get all that data. So uh, yes. 16, 16 AC. 16 AC. Uh, immune to poison. Immune to poison. Okay. Um, it has 64 HP out of 137. Oh, damn. Okay. Uh, was there anything else you, you Been needed? Been shredding from? it. Um, any vulnerabilities or mm, no. resistances? Uh, resistant. Oh, just immune to poison. That's all. That's got. it. Okay. Yeah. That's it. Okay, um, I will walk up to Carter and uh, just kind of pat him on the back, be like, there, there, that's really gross. And I'm going to cast Lesser Restoration on him nice. and cure his poison. There's so much in my suit. Yeah, I can't, <laughs> I can't do anything about that, bud. <laughs> and I will um, <laughs> bonus action wild shape <laughs> into uh, into the Mystic of Okay, nice, nice, and, nice. And move up. Good kid. There's so much <laughs> <laughs> this guy's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I just put three schmucks in space and wildness happens. You well. sure did. Yeah. Okay, um, that's your turn? That is my turn. Carter, you're up. You um, no longer at disadvantage. Feeling better. <clears throat> okay. But you're still dying from you're, HP yeah, damage, you're still right? Um, yeah, I'm out of slots. I've got 22 HP. Um, but I still Holy have... Holy shit, I'm surprised you have that much. I can still... Well, I have a lot, man. Uh, I can <laughs> still uh, I can still impose disadvantage on an attack. Uh -huh, so uh -huh, I'm just uh -huh. going to EB. Uh, that's not good. <laughs> How is an 11? Jesus. Mm -hmm. I Misses. suck. 18. Hits. Yay. 10 damage. Oh, yep. one damage. Oh, fuck. One plus your thingy, right? <laughs> Zeros are 10. You did one damage to it? I did one damage to it. <laughs> All right. Do you add your charisma to your EBs? I did five damage to it. Five damage to it. <laughs> Better than one. <laughs> it is. It is definitely better than one. All right. Next up is Gil. He's gonna take two swipes at it. Um, shit. He hits both times. Nice. So that's a two d eight plus um, six. He rolled a one and a four. Right. He does eleven damage to it. So you guys are you guys are starting to tear into this thing. Um, it's the Spider Drake's turn. It's going to. Hmm, yeah, it doesn't like Sebastian. Sebastian does a lot of damage to it. It's going to make a multi-attack on you, which is three attacks. Holy shit. Uh, you're looking at one bite and two claw attacks. So, cool, cool, the big cool, one will be the bite cool, and the other cool. two claws. Big meaty claws. Oh, oh fuck. That's God. A, those are high numbers, Yes, though. those are very high numbers. Um, the bite does... That's uh, 25. Yeah. The mm -hmm. claws are... 26 and 22. All hit. They all hit, yeah. 22 hits you? I have 22 AC. Why do you have 22? I thought you had 23. Oh, well, okay then. <laughs> if you want to give me 23, I'll take yeah, 23. Yeah, by all means. You know, well, 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 well. <laughs> um, my God. I know. Lord. So, the bite. Things. Oh, that has gone to the abyss almost. almost. It's joined the blood war. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that is that is a total of sixteen um, damage, uh, eight of which is poison for all that matters. Uh, now the claws. Jesus Christ! First claws are fifteen. Ooh. Second claws are um, twelve. Twenty-seven. So well, yeah. What's the total? Twenty-seven plus whatever the initial count was. 
have no idea. We know what it is. <clears throat> 43, right? 43 damage to Sebastian. Yeah. As this Ouch. thing just goes frenzy on him. Ah, and you Se- mother... <laughs> Sebastian, ah, What the up. grumpsh? It's your turn. <laughs> Get out. Yeah, fuck this thing. I'm chopping at it. I'm pissed. That's Let's a true beat. Hell yeah. Mark him. It's a miss. What'd you roll? Oh, wait. We, oh, we didn't take a... Oh, it's going to also re- try and recharge both its breath, breath and its web. Eight, I rolled double sixes. So Flock. both are back. Yahtzee. <laughs> so do we we long rested after I did my guided strike, right? Um, yeah. yeah. Yes. So Wait, I have it back. Did we? Yes. Yes. We mm-hmm. did I'm going to use long that rest. for my first attack so okay. that will hit. Nice. Dope. And then my next attack. As long as it's above a 16. It is a 18. It nice. hits. So for the first one, I will use my last second spell slot. Yes. Let's see here. Harm it. I'm him. Murder it. <laughs> Mel down. Mel down him. 17 for the first. Okay. And then for the second one, I will do a level one cell spell slot. Yes. <laughs> the 11 damage on the second one. Okay. Yeah. He, he's. Down to 20 HP, I yeah. believe. Uh, we both calculating that right? Mm-hmm. Okay. <clears throat> it's great. Now I can just share shit. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Cool. Yes. Dungeon Master in check. <laughs> I do love having this info. I will uh, say that Next much. up is Percy. Ah, these Aim for the kill steal. I'm coming in, and I'm going to do a bite and a claw. Boit. Bite is 16. It hits. Ooh. Oh, fuck. And then that one was 18. higher. 18. Let's get this kill still talking. You are dice crazy right now. Four, six, eleven. So not dead yet. (laughs) Come on, man. Fuck, I did eight. So it has one HP left. Oh my god. (laughs) Guess who's getting it? So I'm just Ah. going and I jump up and... Carter, you're up. Carter, get that motherfucker. This thing's beginning to like stumble around and it's like letting out like this like almost pathetic like uh, cooing sound as it's like going down. It's like... Oh. Yeah, I can't even do it. Oh, sure. I'll just no, not like that. Okay, no, I'll just last uh, twenty something. That hits, and you, you kill, kill it. it. Murder it <laughs> through its thorax. This, this is for all the vomit. <laughs> <laughs> and it goes down, and it goes down its <clears throat> mouth. And it's just like <laughs> <laughs> so. You drop it dead. Yes. Initiative over. Fuck yes. You guys win. Gil immediately hops on top of it and starts chopping off body parts. Cool, cool. <laughs> is this Monster Hunter? Is he just Yeah, getting he's his, like Monster Hunter. Yeah, is he's he like getting his part right right now? So the He just killed the Mulduga. Yeah, he did. Fucking. I can't really thank you enough. Um, I'll share I'll, some of the bounty with you if you want. I'll watch it back. Yeah. Hella want that. So tired, though. We'll, sh- we'll, we'll uh, swap information. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He's, just, he's like cutting off the wings. And Got Venmo? Can I sit <laughs> down? <laughs> yes. I don't know how to clean the vomit out of my suit. <laughs> is there like a... Yeah, you're dealing with that for the next two days. Holy is there shit. like a spigot or something? How I should do you really mean? learn the prestidigitation. You should, yes. I, I only know Vicky, like, how is he going to get this? You guys are upstairs. She's not Oh, there. we are. She's not down there. I, go, I walk downstairs, yeah. Vicky. I throw up in my suit. <laughs> I got, I got She's like, oh, <laughs> that's bad. I got a lot of puke in here. Oh, There's not a lot of space. I'm sorry. You're going to have to deal with it until we get back to the ship. My boots. <laughs> Oh my god, you're, you're just swishing everywhere you go. Oh, it smells. Okay, I don't so. like this. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like having to hear it. Yeah, gross. Um, so, Gil's busy with the beast. So we're um, pretty much splitting so, away from, from so yeah. Gil right now. He's like, right? I'll catch up with you. And he's just like, oh, god, sure, god. Yeah. sure, sure. Yeah. It's been real, Gil. <laughs> uh, let's go to Vic- Vicky. He's got throw up all up in his suit. Please. I guess let's go. Like, yeah, let's go. Well, let's let's go. just go. I'm so tired. Are we able to patch his suit or whatever? Um, or? I didn't have it's a suit. It's not torn. In. It's oh. just full of it's vomit. It's full of vomit. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I think you guys start the, the sad march we back to the We sure ship. do. I'm like at a either, I'm either down or upwind from him. Mm-hmm. I'm upwind from Carter. I mean, no one can smell it. Okay. Only yeah, Carter. only yeah. Carter. Oh, I'm good. Carter. Yeah, only then Carter I'm fine. <laughs> um, Victoria, like, feels around, like, her suit, and she's like, oh, I got something. And she, like, 
pulls out this little vial and she's like, uh, turn around. She's talking to you, Carter. Sure. And she, you hear like her like uncork something on your suit and then she like dumps the vial in there and you just smell like strong mint. <laughs> so it's a strong mint with vomit mixed in. Oh, that's gross. <laughs> that's the best I could do. <laughs> you really should have given me the heads up on that one. And I let like a little more vomit like just fall out of my mouth. <laughs> I'm like, oh, did he throw up again? This is good. She's like, I'm this sorry. I'm sorry. Let's leave. Let's go. So, bad. so after a couple hours of travel, so oh bad in here, after God. a couple hours of travel, uh, Gil catches up to you guys. And he's just packed. Like, oh he's like God. hunched over. He's just got like four foot tall worth of spider drake remains Dope. piled onto his back. Dope. And, uh, hey, guy. <laughs> well, you're looking a little under the weather there. Suits full, suits full of vomit. Oof. Sorry yeah. to hear that. Yeah. Super gross. I wish I could empathize with the problem. But I'm so I'm tired. Construct. So uh-huh, uh-huh. we don't have that. No vomit, huh? What mm. was the uh, what was the bad things about getting the miasma in our suit? Um. Oh yeah, you'll be poisoned it's really being badly. Poisoned? Yeah. That's not me. That's not what happened here. No, I know. I'm just saying. I, I could, got like some kind of concentrate bypass though. I could the poke s- a hole in the thing and then we could like drain you, but then you'd just be poisoned. I don't know if that would solve the problem. Victoria says when we get to the tent, we'll, we'll, we'll pop him. When we make tent, we'll, we'll get him in the in the tent and we'll see what we can do. Oh, gross. Okay. <laughs> can we pop the tent early? <laughs> yeah, we'll pop the tent early. Okay. How let's about do right that. now? <laughs> Can you deal with it for like two more hours? I don't want to spit. You know what? Okay. <laughs> she pops the tent. She pops the tent open oh, for no. you guys. Please. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you guys go through this horrifying. Yes. Like you guys, you get Carter in the tent. You hose him down. The tent's wet, but that's still better than whatever he was going through. Mm-hmm. It smells like mint and yeah. stomach garbage. Ugh. And uh, yeah, mint Victoria. And Victoria is gonna get to work doing her best to clear out your suit. It's going to take her like oh, three what a, hours. What a peach she is. And you guys are probably just going to stay the night here. I'm just mm-hmm. washing my socks in like the basin. <clears throat> That's fair. Yeah. That's fair. So Don't you guys, me you guys make chunks camp. off. <clears throat> yeah. Um, Gil's going to stay outside. <laughs> okay. Uh, are you guys going to do watch or anything? You're just going to knock the fuck out? No, I mean. Um, you going to tell us what's up out there, bud? I'm so tired. Um, Gil. To go. Yeah. But what are you asking him? If he's going to keep watch for us. Yeah, so I'll I'll keep watch. Thanks, bud. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> Carter, Carter. Well, Carter doesn't sleep, but yeah. Yeah, that's just like a turn of phrase. Yeah. So you, Carter lies down. Yeah. I just lie down on the middle of the floor. <laughs> so in the middle of the night, the um, blank look. On everyone's my face. asleep except for Carter because Carter doesn't sleep. Mm. Carter, give me a perception check. Okay. Thirteen. Okay. Sorry, twelve. I don't get a twelve total. Okay. Actually. Okay, you don't notice anything. The night passes without incident. Incident. <laughs> Cool. cool. <clears throat> oh, that's good. Just real quick before I, I fall asleep, happens. I work on my arm to try to get it fixed. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. So, you spend an hour, you fix your arm. So in the morning, who's the first out of the tent? Me. Probably him. All right, Carter, you step out of the tent with your new suit that only smells vaguely like vomit. Mm. And you look, I can live with this. <laughs> you look around, you notice that Gil's not around anywhere. And um, you look down. When you when you you exit the tent and when you look down on the floor, there is a small metal card, like that was like thrown down and like kind of sticking out of the dirt. It's like punctured in by its corner. <clears throat> I inspect it. Mm-hmm. You pick it up, and it. Let me see. I have it described here. Hold on. This is a cutscene where you like press A to activate the action. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> um, here, I'll just describe it because I can't see where I wrote it down. It's a small metal card, mm-hmm. uh, kind of in the shape and size of a business card. Mm-hmm. Um, one side's blank, but the other side has seven symbols, if you will, on it. In it's a circle. blank. <clears throat> oh, wait. <laughs> oh, wait. <It> turns <laughs> it around. There are seven masks in a circle. Uh-oh. And you see that one of the masks ma- matches the face Gil has. Mm-hmm. Like That looks like Gil's face. Sure. Mm. Um, give me a history check. Okay. 18. Oh, God, that's really good. Yeah, I got okay, a plus cool. five to that. You've been doing some reading. You recognize Always. this card as the calling card for a group of Warforged bounty hunters called the Freelancers. Damn it. And they are the most notorious bounty hunters in the galaxy. They're legendary. You don't know all of their names, but you know a couple of them. Um, each of them has a name, and they work together, 
and they only work on the highest bounties like ever oh, the most dangerous no. people ever and they're exorbitantly expensive to hire but they don't care about money they're immortal they've been doing this for thousands of years they um they will hunt somebody down and the only thing that will stop them is if all seven get defeated if all seven get killed um they're kind of like liches where they're their consciousness gets downloaded and sent to a new body. Oh, but shit. But if all seven of their uh, bodies are defeated, that person gets a free pass, and they no longer pursue that person. Oh. And that's only happened once in the history of free- the freelancers. Looks like we're And who was the escapee? Kill a bunch of robots. Who killed seven of these guys. If if, it's, if I know it's only happened you, once, then... You know him as a halfling named Jack Farstrider. Nice. He lived 500 years ago. Motherfucker. Okay. Um, so am I to discern that this dude was one of these guys or this dude got sniped? Um, again, one of the masks on there is the face of Gil. I think that I think you can imply that he's one of the seven. Damn it. He lied to me. Yeah, man. We I tried <laughs> to inside him and I natty won. Yeah. <laughs> you were like, are you a bounty hunter? And, and he was like, no. That's <laughs> so true. Stupid. Um, uh, you rolled an 18, <laughs> so you know sort of like, you know that the leader of the freelancers himself. goes by the name of the guild master. Why he do this? Why he ride side and by? he did call himself Gil. The guild master. <sighs> Gil. Mm-hmm, 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 he get mm-hmm. that strong intel on us to try and fight us. He's conning us right now. <clears throat> I mean, you haven't revealed this to anyone yet, so we would have beat his yeah. ass, we hardcore. We should have. We could have beat. Right we could have beat the one. Oh, dang. I mean, did he see Sebastian without <clears throat> the um, face mask? Yes. Come on. It, it Absolutely. Come down eventually. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Are you gonna, can can you reveal well, to I'm the other curious, people yes. so that we can we can move forward and I yeah. can tell you things? Yeah. Guys, <laughs> everybody, wake up! Guys, wake up! What's what, go- Carter? Uh, what do you want? My suit. It only kind of smells like vomit now. That's that's great. Cool, Carter. Oh, also, Victoria steps out. And she's like, oh, all right. So are we good to go today. Great work on the suit, Vicky. Hey, uh, where's Gil? Uh, yeah. yeah where, where's where Gil? <laughs> Gil's dead to me. I show them the bounty. The, the, what? The bounty Victoria the takes the card and she looks at it. I'll look at it. And she's just like looking at it for like a long minute. That one's Gil. The one <clears> right there. She looks at you, Sebastian. You go, Sebastian, can I see your axe, please? Um, sure. Do you give it to her? Yeah. She grabs the axe and then she just marches off into the woods and you just hear her screaming and <laughs> chopping at everything around her. And she's just like, fuck, god damn it, son of a cock-sucking motherfucking <laughs> god, da, da. I'll look at him and, and be she's like, just oh, out there for a good minute doing that. That motherfucker <laughs> lied to me. <laughs> <laughs> I asked him if he was a bounty hunter. He told me no. <laughs> and now Percy's learned that People lie sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> My childish innocence is God. <laughs> so after a minute, Victoria comes back. She hands you the axe. She says thank you. She looks really sweaty, and she's just like, Better. "Let's go." I sit her. Uh, let's uh, go. Gonna, I put my hand keep... on her shoulder. I'm like, "See, this is what happens when you help people." <laughs> <I'm> not... <laughs> I asked you guys if we should. I'm help. making a solemn vow to, I'll turn... to you, to you, Carter, to you, Sebastian, and to you, everybody here. I'm not helping nobody no more. <laughs> <laughs> and so I take it you guys pack up and leave. Percy, you're right. This is about us. I'm gonna this be a different. Us. I'm gonna be a different. This is thing about what than we a need. Galactic druid. I'm gonna be like. And <laughs> Victoria's just muttering herself. She's like a fucking course. Like he got the read on the Brunhilde's firepower with his first stunt. He got our trust. He saw everything we were capable of doing. He learned all about us. Mm-hmm. He did all that. He came here looking for us. He knew we were going to be he here. We here. He he was the cloak guy you guys talked about from the Obsidian Dragoon. Probably. When asking questions. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I was going to ask that. Mm-hmm. God mm-hmm. damn it. Mm-hmm. Packs up 10. Packs up 10. <laughs> okay. Packs up so 10 do you guys head back early. to the ship? I thought maybe Gil had a bounty on him for a second. But yes. his face is on the card and that means that it's him. But he's like, the hunt is on. He's playing games. <laughs> he's I guess games. just trying to be as attentive as we can. Because, I mean, he's gone. He left his calling card. But I mean, maybe there's a bigger bounty. And he's like, are you guys up to the task? <laughs> he's just con- so this is conning us for this other is reasons. 10 mil right 10 here. And what, 50 mil for Prim? 50 mil for Prim. And did he see Prim? 
Uh, yeah, he's up. He did. We were all chilling. He did right. It's not even that he had to see you guys. He knew. Yeah, he, knew. he knows he knew who, who you guys were. are. He yeah. could have swooped her in yeah. the night. I would have yeah. seen it, but it's true. All right, that's um, damn. I'm use, I'm useful as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> um, can, Apparently not. So, do you guys head back to the ship? Yeah, dog. Okay, yeah. cool. Sad. The uh, is there anything you guys want to do over the next two days, or, or can we just fast forward? I, I want to like reconstruct the outside of the Broomhilda to look like a completely different vessel. <laughs> okay, well, I want to. Two I wanna days later, cast you guys come person on Sebastian <laughs> and tired out of the jungle onto the desert dune. The Broomhilda is still sitting there waiting for you guys. Watt sees you guys approaching. He opens up the hatch or the descending platform, or whatever. You guys get on board the ship, okay. and you hear Watt over the intercom. Ah, oh, fuck. We have a problem. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Sebastian. Uh, a communication came in for you. You should uh, come um, up here. Uh, okay. What now? Of course it did. Yeah. <laughs> I have my helmet off for my suit, and I just like put it in Percy's face. Like, you smell that? <clears throat> it's really nasty. <laughs> Get that shit um, on. We kind of like vomit, right? Do you guys go yeah. to walk? Yep, we're walking. The, I'm yeah. so we're walking up, up to the. Okay. So you guys get up there, and Watt me. looks pretty grim, and he and we all presses play grim. on the monitor, and you guys see an image of um, Captain Dabarax oh, from gosh. the Iron Legion on Ellis Horizon. Whoa! <clears throat> and this is a pre-recorded message. <laughs> Sebastian, you're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> what happened, bro? <laughs> Corporal Crenshaw, I hope this finds you in good health. I regret to inform you that this communication does not bring glad tidings. You're being ordered to appear at the Central Command on Sovereign. You are to put, be put on trial to discern your innocence against the accused crimes of the Eternal Empire. <clears throat> You're commanded to arrive by Stardate 9965 on the 16th of Domin. Failure to appear will be considered an admission of guilt. I'm sorry to bring you this news, but I will also be in attendance to speak on your behalf. For the glory of Dominion, signing off. And that shit. is where we're ending today's session of Super Son Quest Saga. Bitch. If you guys like the show, if you like what we do here, please like, subscribe, Why and will? comment. Please leave a review on Why? iTunes, and we will talk to you guys later. Damn. Why? <laughs> well, why? Why? I swear to God. <laughs>